Hey, hey, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be teaching you a simple trick when it comes to Facebook group organization. Do you have a Facebook group? Let me know in the comments what it's about. If you have a Facebook group, using this simple trick can really help you and your group members find content within the group. What's the tip? Post topics. I'm gonna to show you how to set this up and how I use them inside my Facebook groups. This is part one of a four video series that I will be doing on Facebook group organization. Make sure to pay attention in the coming weeks for those videos. Before we jump into today's training, welcome to my channel, The Parisi Pack. I'm so happy to have you here. My name is Stephanie Parisi and I am the leader of The Parisi Pack. It is my private coaching community on Facebook. I love helping busy moms grow their influence and their profits using social media strategies that actually work. If you like what you're hearing, hit that subscribe button and then hit that bell to get notified when new videos are released. Let's dive into this. Here I am on Facebook and I am going to go to one of my groups that's called the Parisi Pack. And this is my private social media coaching group. It's a membership community. And you can see over here, right above my little face in the screen, you can see popular topics in posts. And you can see if I click here, manage, this is gonna pop up and I have all these different post topics that are assigned with different trainings in them. So it's really helpful for me and it's helpful for other people when you're searching for information on a certain topic. But before I show you how to do this, let me show you a couple things when it comes to your settings. You're gonna to get to this main page of your group and you're gonna see this little button that here that says more. And you're gonna click on that button and then you can go down to where it says edit group settings. Pop that up. And then I have my group type set to social learning. Okay, so make sure if you're educating what you're doing in your group, you want that to be set to social learning. And then I'm going to scroll down. And here you can see it. There is a button that says post topics. And then you can check the box post topics, organize posts by adding relevant topics to them. So there, I just unchecked it. Now I'm going to recheck it. So make sure that button is checked. And then all you're going to do is make sure you click save. So your changes have been saved. Perfect. Now I'm going to go back to the main hub. Here's my group again. And here's all these different post topics I've done in the past. Let me show you how this works. For instance, here is a training that we had last night in the group on automation and sales funnels. And so if I click the three dots, you can see this pop up and here is the option where it says add post topic. I'm going to click that button, select a topic to describe this post. So I can select one of these topics or I can type in my own. And you can see because this is something new, I was going to type sales funnels here. I'm typing sales funnels here and I don't have any other trainings in the group so far on this topic. So I can create sales funnels as a post topic and that's it. And I then click the save button. So now let's see how it saves. So let's go back over to these post topics and you can see here is sales funnels in one post. So if I click on that, it's going to take me directly to the one post with the topic. So it's very, very cool. People are asking questions about Facebook groups, like what this YouTube video tutorial is about. Here, I could go and click on that post topic in the group and then get all these different questions that people have asked. It's a really easy way for members to find information. Now, let me show you how to do another post topic. Today, one of my members asked me a question about emails and email lists. So I could assign a post topic to this group question. And I am going to type in your email list because I already have a topic about that and then hit the save button. And now you can see here that just popped up. Now the topic is assigned. 
Let's keep going. Here's another example. I did a training recently on all things Facebook pages when it comes to increasing views and engagement on your Facebook page, how you're doing that for your business, and just little tips and tricks and hacks. And so this is something new that I did in the group just a couple days ago. So I'm going to add a post topic. I'm going to add, type in Facebook pages. Create Facebook pages, and then I'm going to click the Save button. This is how to do it on a desktop. Here, just going back to that Manage button within the group. And so now it's just a very easy way for you and also your group members to locate information, and it keeps things very simple. So let me pop over onto my phone so you can quickly see how this is set up on a phone. So here I'm opening up Facebook, and then I'm going to go to the Group button. I'm going to head back over to the Precy Pack, my group, and now I am going to show you here the popular topics. That's your post topics. And so this is how it looks like on a phone. And so you can click on different ones. I'm going to click on the Productivity tab, open that up, and then a group member would be able to find anything related to training that I've done on productivity. Back to the topic button, now I'm clicking on the post topic stories. And now I can go look at questions, trainings, anything related to stories that's in the Facebook group. So now let me show you how to add a post topic on your phone. Here's a post called Replay Rise Up. I highlight a training that I've done in the past and give members an opportunity to win something by completing the training. So I'm going to add a post topic to this. So I'm going to click that Add Post Topic button, and then in the upper corner, I'm going to create a new post topic because I'm typing it in here and you can see it's not popping up. So I hit that Create button, and then I'm going to type in Replay Rise Up. And now, Replay Rise Up is added as a post topic to this post. Here's another example. Here's a post where someone's asking a question about how I made the post. So I'm going to add a post topic. To this one, it's going to fall under post creation. I already have that category. I tag the button and boom, post creation is now the post topic. And that's it. Go get organized and set up post topics within your own group. Are you looking to grow your influence and your profits online? Then grab your spot in the Parisi Pack, my private coaching community. You can find the Parisi Pack on Facebook.